What's up everyone and welcome to you on the Moonshot YouTube channel. Hope that you're all doing very well. As always, we're going to see here what we can expect next if we are in a bullish count on Bitcoin. So to speak, if this right here was the bottom and so if we can expect higher next, we're going to cover everything using a lot waves. And yeah, we're going to cover all this push to the upside here, everything really. So you can really fully understand it what we are more likely. Okay, before to start, as always, thank you so much again. Uh, for the 500 subscribers on the YouTube channel, even now the 1,000, this is just absolutely crazy. Uh, so thank you all for this, and uh, yeah, welcome to all the new members. And if you want, I mean, yeah, just to thank you all for this, there is a giveaway running on the website. It's absolutely free. Just to thank you for the 500 subscribers. So just go and check this out. You have everything, the description, all the information. You have to go on the main page here, create an account, and just yeah. Yeah, you have three different prices just, just to the steps here. We have three different prices. You have the price in the one that is a one to one session with me. So you spend one hour with me, and I'm teaching you clearly the order flow, for example, this or if I can load that perfect, the order flow or the, um, elite waves. Okay, depends on what you prefer. I'm going to recall for one hour this session, and then I'm going to send this to you. And in addition to this, there is a PDF I'm going to make before to do the session so I can we can get a plan. And again, and I'm going to give you also this PDF at the end. Okay. So yeah, if you want to get a chance, just go on the website and uh, yeah, just take this out really, it's absolutely free and just do the steps here and you will just follow the steps and you will be able to win anything. I mean, possibly, you will be able possibly to win one of the three prices. So price number two is an MC switch shirt and the price number three is the Exo Chance Month. This Exo Chance Month here, there are three winners, so at the end there are three prizes, but there is there are three uh, five winners, that's pretty cool. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, let's start with this. So here, what I have on the bigger time frame, it's simply here, an impulsive. Okay, so we have an impulsive here. I mean, some of you already know my, my, my wave count, really. We do have some data missing here. You have to go on index and everything. But yeah, I'm taking more of this as a five ways, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, can it, is it possible to still be in this kind of way? One, two, three, this is a way four, and we're going to push for a way five. Yes, it is. Okay, because we do not break the wave one top. But I mean, at some point, look at that wave four. It's absolutely huge after a very, very big wave two. So technically, it's still valid. But I mean, it it looks a lot less probable to be fair with you, uh, and to be honest with you, simply because that wave four is extremely big and the wave two here was extremely big already. So yeah, I'm not going to bet on this. That's why I'm taking here a bigger wave one, bigger wave two. But keep in mind that on a bigger time frame, we can still be in a wave five. Okay, if you go for example here on the index price, you do have um, different possible accounts. For this but um, that is the super bullish one for example that is a less bullish one for example we will just get a wave five so you can see we're in this wave in such wave one two we do have a wave one two three or five so we complete that wave three we are in a wave four we've made that wave four and now we look for that wave five so we can get just one more push to the upside but uh, in my opinion it's not to make this wave one two three four and five it's simply to make this bigger cycle one two three, four, five, if we get our last push up and get a very big crash next, okay? Again, I'm covering only the bullish plan in this video. There is a bearish plan. We have to be aware of both. This is extremely important if you want to trade Bitcoin good in the right way, okay? But anyway, so let's jump in here. Uh, yes, right here. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. So here, let's go on the daily time frame, by the way, so I can explain you here what I have here to the downside. Okay, so here, first of all, uh, my wave count start from here. Okay, I have an ABC flat. Then this ABC flat is turning that case into a double XY. Okay, double XY here. Uh, that is a bigger double XY at the end. Okay, and so next, as always, bigger double XY. So here we have another bigger W, X, and Y with a nice ABC zigzag here to the downside. Okay, again, you can go and watch my price updates for full details about all this drop here, so you can really fully understand that. But yeah, the most important is right here if the wave two bomb is in or you know if the wave four on a bigger 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 time frame wave four bomb is in and now we are looking for a bullish move and for a very big and larger push to the upside okay what waves we can take here to the upside I'm gonna make it very simple i'm gonna take this as five waves that's simple that really because if you take this as for example five waves correction five waves then that's a correction to go more down or to go still higher okay but it's a full bigger correction in that case to go more down. So in that case, this will be part of the bearish count. The second video I'm going to make about this, okay, about the bigger time frame waves. So here, bullish count in that case, simple, simple, simple. You do have five ways up, so you take this as a wave. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, you do have, so the smaller wave, um, yeah, I mean, I do have a small way of this. Uh, the, the way through, for example, is very, 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 very complex, not gonna lie. Like, uh, yeah, you, you do have some very complex stuff in there, not gonna lie. But yeah, this will be, I mean, 
mean, if we're in this configuration, even in the bearish can, by the way, these are five ways, we have a correction, we have another five ways, we have a correction, we have another five ways. So as always, if we're in these five ways, okay, if we have a five ways up, then we'll have to look for a correction and then another five ways to the upside. Even with this bullish plan, it cannot really be fully bullish simply because as always, it can be if we have five ways before, an ABC zigzag or an impulse. I'm gonna explain you this here. For example, if you do have a five waves to the upside, so let's take a wave one, two, three, four, five. What can be what can gives what can give next these five waves here to the upside? It can simply give first of all an ABC zigzag. So you do have an A, a B, and a C. And so you do have another five waves here. Okay, again, you have everything, all this course right here. If you want to learn really elite waves, you have all of this for free on the website, absolutely free. Okay, do I just have to join us as a member and you will get all of this. So let's just pull all of this, bam. So you do have this ABC zigzag, just gonna reduce the waves, like, oops, like this right here. And so I'm gonna turn this right there into with the waves. So right here, so this is an ABC zigzag. In case you have five waves up, this is a first possible pattern you can expect. Now, the thing is, what is the other configuration that do, that start also with five waves here? It's simply an impulsive. So this is in that case a wave one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So there are two different configurations, ABC zigzag or one, two, three, four, five impulsive to the upside. Okay. Do we, do, 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 these are the exact same smaller wave, just here it's bigger. Okay. And oops, for the way three, it will be bigger, the five ways, okay? And if we get an ending, so to speak, if we get this, an ending here, which to the upside, okay? It's definitely a C wave, okay, right here, because a way three cannot finish with an ending, it's not possible. So yeah, these are the two configurations, impulsive, okay? Or ABC zigzag, and the smaller way of the wave one, two, three, or ABC are exactly the same, except that the way three can, uh, can get only an impulsive and the C wave can get an ending. So if you get an ending in this push up, then that's a C wave for sure. Okay, hope that makes sense. So now if we go below here, we do have the first five ways to the upside. We are now in the correction, you know, the ABC exam will shrink, you know, of course, is a much, I mean, a bit of a bigger comp uh, co correction, uh, more complex sorry, correction, uh, because that's the bullet X, Y, X, and Z we're getting here to the downside. But yeah, so <clears throat> this is the correction we are in, we, we have in the B, okay, I was showing before. I'm gonna make the, the same color, you know what? It's gonna be much more easier, I think, like this to understand. Really hope that makes sense, okay? So we do have the pink five waves, so we do have the A wave here to the upside. We do have then in that case a B wave, and then we'll have the C here to the upside, you know, with the five waves again, oops, with these five waves right here again, okay? With this nice five waves here to the upside. But again, can this be, I mean, is it bullish to make this ABC zigzag? No, because that's a correction to go more down. So this will also be part of the bearish plan. But I just want to cover that so you're you're aware of it, okay? That even if we can be bullish because that can be an impulsive, it can still be with this ABC zigzag, so still be bearish. We can get a rise, but still to be bearish at the end. In that case, this will be simply to be in this bam, bigger W, W, X, and a Y, okay? A bigger, correction here to the downside, we'll just change that a bit. Okay, it will be simply a bigger here, WXY. Really hope that makes sense. Now, as I said, I am not going to focus on the bearish count right now, just to give you an idea, really. Okay, we're not gonna focus on this mainly at all in this update. So we're gonna hide this ABC zigzag. Let's take the case that we are now really bullish and we're in this impulsive. First of all, what you have to understand is that we have 73% chance to go between the 50 and the 66, sorry, persons. So we should normally start these five ways a bit below. Now we still went, as you can see here, into the first target, into the first fib. Okay, if you just hide this because we don't see so much. We already hit that first target. There is a 38.2, this is a target where we hit. If we're really super bullish, this is something we do most of the time, for example, here, uh, or 38.2, or even less, for example, here was really super bullish. Look at the, re the, the retracements we have done here. It's simply above the 38.2 here, okay? We just make some crazy small retracement because it means that we are going to do a crazy push up next, okay? So here we have done a 38.2, so it is possible, but again, we started six, we have still more chance to go between the 50 and the 61, uh, 6.86 6 person. We have more chance to go there, we have 73% chance to go there. So I am going to take the case that we are going to go below here, okay? So let's pull the wave here so you can really see everything, okay? Bam. Let's pull this below. I'm gonna move this, the squares by the way here. I'm gonna delete this and move this a bit more on the right so you can really see where are the buy zones. Oh, oops, right there. Right 
here and here. Good. So yeah, these are the bisons, okay? Where we can look for to, to buy if you want if you want to play with this bullish scenario. From here, so wave two here a bit below. So what we have to look for, I mean a bit below between the 50 and 6 percent So what we have to look for here, and then we start the five waves, okay? We need to look for this. We're also going to to find a price after. So yeah, make sure to stay if you want to get the price. Uh, just gonna pull this a bit more higher. I'm going to, to show you the possible price of the way 3, 4, and 5, the possible projection, the price projection. So yeah, uh, here, in that case, into that wave 2, okay, what I have here to the downside is simply, as I said earlier, a double EX, Y, X, and Z. Okay, this is what we have been trading. This is how we have been able from the top to predict the drop from here to predict the pump and another possible move to the downside. Okay, so this was all planned in advance. We were aware of that. We just have been trading this. And uh, yeah, we have to go and check out the last update, if you the latest updates if you want to, uh, to see a bit how we have been able to predict all of this if you want to learn from here but yeah now if we have more chance to go between the 56 one and 66 percent then we are simply going to look for a bigger triple wave okay so in that case we can look for a possible bigger double exy if i can pull the wave here yeah perfect so we can look for a bigger double exy right here okay double exy or as always if the double if the x wave sorry here takes the w root we have to switch to a an abc flat so in taking that case an a bam a b and a C flat. Okay, so we take this like that. Bam. Just gonna hide the turret for a uh, really quick here. Uh, where are this? Oh, yeah, I'm stupid. Uh, the reason why I was like, where are the squares? <laughs> was here before. Yeah, it's normally detailed everything. Uh, nice. <coughs> so, yeah, two different configurations. Double the XY. Okay, first of all, we have to look for if the X wave here breaks the A wave root. Then we simply have to remove this WXY and take this ABC flat. Okay? In that case, where are the targets of this B wave? We just have to pull our retracement tool from the A wave bottom to the A wave top. Okay? And pull our flat target. Again, you have everything for free on the website if you want to know how to do this, what fib you have to use, how to place it. And again, you do the opposite if you did not reverse your tool. I reversed my tool here in the settings, so it's from the bottom here to the top, otherwise from the top to the bottom. It depends how you do if you, I mean, if you reverse or remove your tool. So from here, we're going to look for this target right here, this red box, okay? And so yeah, from here, we're going to look for the five ways to the downside for the ABC flat. So we have a correction. So here it's a triple way. I'm going to show you triple this five ways because that's a double X, Y, X, and Z, but this is a correction. Here we have another correction. And here we're going to get a five ways, one, two, three, four, five, to go, you know, into our target here, okay? Into our 56, 186 percent. Okay, well, we can just swing through upon here again, but it's all about privacy. So I'm going to make it very simple. I'm going to take the highest privacy. So, yeah, this is the plan, really. Okay, if we are in the, if we go above, really, and stop and break the W root. Okay, now if the B wave close, start getting some car close above, here's a Y23, Y27, we simply remove this and we take the case that the wave two was done. Okay, simple as that, really. And so we take this as a wave one. Two, three, or five. We're going to make five ways. So maybe a bigger wave, one, two, and bam. Here we go. Pump it up. Three, four, five. Okay. Again, be careful, please, because that impulsive. I'm not saying that we are bullish. Okay. I'm not saying this at all. It just I'm showing you the possible count in case we are bullish. You know the wave to take. You know in what we are. I'm not saying we have to look for these waves directly. No, of course not. We have to be aware of this first. This ABC is exact because it can be just a C wave and then it's a drop. Okay, there are no way four, five, or whatever. We are maybe not going to push that high for the way three because we're in a C wave, right? Okay, so the small waves are, are the same, so we really have to be careful and not take this directly and mainly this. Okay, very important to understand this. So now, if we have to go in the most probable target for the wave two, and next we'll have to do this impulsive here, what are the prices we can expect next? Okay, so let's go here on the weekly time frame. Gonna be much more easier for me to play the fibs. Let's take the case that we are going. To, I'm gonna pull this on the right so it's a bit better like this so we can see better what's happening we're going to pull the extension tool from the wave one root to the wave one top to the wave two bottom again I'm taking the case that we are going to go to the 6186 percent from here we pull our extension tool and the most common target for the wave three is a 1618 again be aware of that the 120 extension is an is a um, is a is it is a first area but we have only two percent chance to stop here so it's really less probable that's why i'm not going to take this the, uh, the, the one twenty extension i'm going to place it on the most common target the one six twenty now again be aware of that 
when we're in a bull market, so speak like this, we do not stop on the more likely target, we do some extensions. And so, I mean, some extensions, we go into above targets, we really higher targets. So for example, here, why is the maximum target? Again, we can do an extension, it's possible to go really above all the targets. Now, the maximum target with this FIB is the 23.6. So maximum relief after being a crazy bull run, we can look for for now to get some some good prices. Okay, if we really have to make something extremely bullish, now if we have to do this, we can absolutely do this. Okay, it's possible to make a crazy extension. It's absolutely possible. Now, if you respect the fibs, maximum trade is around ninety thousand on Bitcoin. Now, again, I'm not a super bullish guy or a super bearish guy. I'm gonna stay neutral in place where we have more chance to stop. Okay, so to speak here, one six one eight of the way three is a maximum, I mean, not, not all the maximum, the most common target. Then, once we have done a 56, 186 percent retracement, we have a high probability of stopping on the 38.2 retracement, so to speak. I mean, between the 23.6 and the 38.2, but we have more chance to go in here to 38.2. So, in that case, bam, we place a way four on the 38.2, that is the 120 extension of the way three. From here, we just pull our extension tool, third click on the way four bottom, and we're at our way five target. First target, it gives a truncated, I mean, a double bo a double top here, so I was playing third pan. It is less probable when you're in an impulsive. So, we look for the next target. This one here is again the most probable. If you notice, this one to one extension of the wave five is a 28% of the wave three. If the wave three is 1618. Okay, if you pull this like that, bam. Uh, is it well placed here? I think I took the 618, yeah, like this. So, yeah, you can see here this 28% this of the wave three is a 1 to 1 of the wave five. See? So, this is how you can draw a really fast little wave. It's 1618. Uh, 120 extension or 20 person okay hope well, that makes sense so yeah, this is the most common impulsive to the upside now just for fun okay just for fun if you really if we are really super bullish and so of course this will be the five ways in there okay this will be the five ways up there up here in the way three if now we are really super bullish let's take the case that we are super bullish just to see and get an idea of the price we can get really maximum again there is no real maximum because if it has to push high it can absolutely push higher okay but just for fun let's see a bit what we can get here if we really have to do the biggest extension here uh, using the extension tool just so we can get an idea of the price we can reach so from here 423.6 maximum target from here retracement again 38.2 so it's a very big drop on <laughs> i am a minus 30 percent that's pretty big from here pull your third click on the way for bottom and from here one uh, by the way that will not be the 120 extension that will be the 2618 here uh bam way five so 618 truncated less probable 120 extension truncated less probable 1618 double top less probable as you can see it can still plays out but now remember the more probable is to go to the way five here 2618 that brings us at 100,000 on bitcoin so if we have to be bullish and we stay with some uh, realistic targets still very 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 big push to the upside but still realistic, tar realistic targets while using the fibs we should reach normally 100,000 on bitcoin okay yeah, so 100,000, except if, of course, we do a double top here, such as this, for example, we can go just a bit above to reach, for example, 95,000, do not hit, for example, or maybe uh, 99,000, such as what we have done here, 69 and not 70,000, we can do something like this, or maybe you reach, I don't know, 89,000 and not 90,000, 90, we can do something like this, you know, like what we have done before, it's possible. Now, yeah, it was just to give you an idea of what we can do really if we have to push to the upside with this kind of very, very, very bullish scenario. Okay, but yeah, as I'm not too bullish or not too bearish, I am neutral. I'm just trying what's happening on the chart really. I am going to stay with this configuration. But yeah, be aware that if we're in a bull market, we can get some very, very, very big push to the upside, so some extensions normally. Okay. So yeah, um, these are in that case the smaller waves uh, of this push to the upside. Again, if we start from here, then what are these waves here we got? We've got here to the upside. Okay, this this right here. Let me just pull that. Hide this. What are these waves? It's simply here in that case an A. Uh, sorry, a wave one, two, and here we go already three, four, five. And so once we have done this five wave, we simply look for a bigger wave one, bigger wave two, and here we go three, four, five. Okay. Sometimes we do not do this bigger wave one, bigger wave two here, bigger wave one, bigger wave two, and bam, three or five. We just stay with these five waves like that, and we do some crazy small waves. Okay, but we do some crazy push to the upside with these small waves like that. Okay, it's something possible too. So people that will wait for the retracement, for example, will never get that retracement. 
Okay, so for example, you will get something like this. A cra what? <laughs> it's crazy, uh, but you can get something like that. Okay, and then you will get another wave one, another wave two, bam, three, four, five, or maybe a, a three like that, and a crazy correction, maybe an ABC flying a, a raw case for the flat, then a wave five, or a very small retracement here, and a big wave five, and then another wave one, another wave two, bam, three, four, five, three. You can make something like that. It's possible, okay? But more often, you're gonna make a bigger wave one, bigger wave two still. Okay, it's something you, you do mo most of the time. So yeah, uh, this is the bullish count really. So yeah, really hope that makes sense. Really hope you enjoy that one. And again, be aware that I'm showing you this, but I'm, it's not because I am looking for this mainly. I'm just covering today in this video, the bullish wave count. But again, we can still be bearish. If you remember good here, it can absolutely be here an ABC zigzag and not at all an impulsive here to the upside. Okay, so yeah be careful please this is extremely important but yeah so yeah we have seen the possible price we can reach on bitcoin if we are bullish a possible wave so you know exactly what we can expect next so you're ready if we're pushing higher now and we're doing some crazy push-up you know exactly what wave you have to take to the upside really for a bullish now if we're a bearish i'm going to record another video during the week i'm gonna add you if it's already available or at the end of this video or above here and already on the top right so you can really click this and check out the, the bearish plan and as always if you enjoy the content don't forget to smash that like subscribe to the channel to turn notifications once again there is a giveaway for absolutely free just to thank you for the 500 and even now 1000 subscribers on the youtube channel just to thank you for this i run a absolutely free giveaway where you have the chance to spend one are a full hour with me uh, where I'm teaching you L wave or is or try, depends what you prefer. I'm recording this one to one session so you can get it and so you can watch it again. And I'm, I'm also doing a PDF before to do the session so you can really also get uh, something where you have notes on it. And I'm also giving you this PDF to you. Um, I'm giving you the PDF at the end so you can also get the video plus the PDF so you can really get everything uh, plus all my explanation, everything in the view. Second price MC Switch shirt, third price one exo chance one for free. Again, this is this uh where you can read an order flow this is clear an order flow or you have also some levels such as that for example right here you have a naked session path to a tpo daily weekly and monthly naked path control here okay there are some levels you really need to trade the market the right way and very good okay such as for example uh this morning okay i'm live by the way every single day of the week at 10 a.m utc plus 2 to update the chart so for example if you are watching this update today you've got an update this morning at 10 a.m just go and check this out you have to go in the live section right here and check out this you're going to get all the informations on how i'm going to trade uh bitcoin today really on the on the current day and what we can expect next week on the bigger time frame on the lower time frame you have some trades that we're also on the ounce on the ounce very 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 important just join the discord server if you want to get such predictions i would say it to vips uh not not to vips anymore by the way the vips not is not is not here anymore so it's for everyone on the on the discord server you have i was looking for the swing food pan here into the mcf which is what i said to my uh into to the team really to, to everyone really on this call server for a long i do like the mcf with the ns uh, with the swing through pan of the law so to speak this right here swing through pan into the mcf again the mcf for example if you're using a little wave this is something you won't find anywhere else simply because this is what i've created again i did not create the fit but i created the, these values because i ran it some statistics on this and you can see how perfect this is playing just look at that we just got a swing through pan and a swing through pan went exactly into our mc fib and from here i posted this live in the time we've got a swing through pan and from here get this right we also got this on solana I was looking for this nice buy zone before to look for a way five the target here for the way five now we've got a crazy push up an extension up 600 percent on this we've got look at that push up i mean this is just absolutely insane and this was just during the weekend during the weekend so to speak in two days uh today uh, yeah, yeah, it was yesterday by the way you've got two nice trades available on the discord server you also have a bnb setup active you also have a dot uh, you also have some dot tas on a bigger time frame for investment for example uh so yeah you have you do have some few, few different stuff in there i'm so uh, i'm also posting some some few information there on bitcoin for example yesterday night when we got the pump you've got i, I posted with you all the i mean i posted all the targets clearly have to be aware of on uh, to the upside and also say here not the best data for a short okay so when we did that week here we've got the retracement I just said hey these are not the best data for a short okay it can change it's possible because i'm going to go to sleep so i'm not going to read the order flow but for now it is not these, these data are not good for a short and so bam late it was still not bearish during the night and from here we did 
took the highest one small. So if you took the short, for example, here, you took the short here, you will take a loss. Okay. So I'm also posting some updates like this live in a time. For example, I took a scalp short on that right here. Once we took the highest some few more times, we've got some nice data. We took the highest one small. Who cares? That's not a problem. That was a scalp turning into a swing. It's like, for example, uh, that long trade from 24,000 or even, for example, from 15,000. I'm still in my long from the very, very, very bottom here. These were some scalp turning into a swing. So this, for example, this was a scalp. Now I'm stopped out, stopped down entry. So I, didn't, I, I did make profit on this. Took probably 50% at the right of the move. Then get stopped down entry. Because after you take profit, you said you stop loss entry. So yeah, now just have to re enter because we took the highest once more. We re enter again if the data are good. And otherwise, the data are not good. We just wait for later for beta data, right? So anyway, you have a lot of stuff on the Discord server here where you have all the updates really i'm also going to be live uh so not um on the discord server okay we're going to be live on the discord server not all the time on the youtube channel so make sure to join the discord server everything really is happening in there uh, to really be aware of everything to talk with everyone um yeah this is the place to be if you want to join the community really in addition to the youtube channel and yeah anyway i wish you all a brilliant day thank you again so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed don't forget to smash that like subscribe to the channel turn notifications and yeah i catch you all later for the daily updates at 10 a.m utc plus 2 or for the next videos around yeah the afternoon for a possible bearish count on bitcoin yep sorry where we're going to see a massive drop uh but yeah anyway have a nice day take care and catch you all in the next one cheers